Located on the sandy shores of Malibu's Puerco Beach, Kanye spent an incredible $57.3 million on this minimalistic seaside mansion that's been described as a livable sculpture. However, this Malibu mansion is anything but disappointing. The as of 2021, Kanye West is officially a billionaire, meaning he can buy any sort of extravagant home he likes even if it's a small $57 million mansion that fans are calling underwhelming. Every room has an ocean view, and the lack of a yard is made up for by a rooftop terrace. Let's explore Kanye's strangest home purchase yet, and see why Yeezy just had to have this unique art house. Penthouse-style master suite and waves flowing directly up to the home's back door. Concrete creation was designed by a world-famous architect, the concrete home was designed by Tadao Ando, the renowned architect behind such creations as He Art Museum in China and Bourse de Commerce in Paris. This Malibu mansion is one of his only U.S. properties. He also designed this ritzy condo building in New York. But Kanye was able to purchase the property at a major discount in an off-market sale. But Kanye's small concrete mansion's uniqueness makes the home stand out. The Malibu home comprises of a 3,665-square-foot house and a 5,672-square-foot lot. It's squeezed in between other Malibu beach houses and features an unassuming frontage with concrete and frosted glass. Luckily, we have many photos of the home's exterior, and you can see some of its interior features through the house's many windows. In fact, the entire back of the house is made up of windows. Since it was purchased in an off-market deal, there are no interior photos of the unique home. But Marmol Radziner, the LA-based architecture firm who worked with Ando, described the decor as minimalistic yet warm. The mansion is divided into three stories. The bottom floor features three guest bedrooms. The middle floor is made up of shared space, such as the living room, kitchen, and guest bathrooms. And the top floor is home to the primary suite. Total, there are four bedrooms and four and a half bathrooms which is described as looking like a luxurious penthouse. Every room in the home offers uninterrupted ocean views. Though there's no yard, Kanye's new home offers outdoor space via a second-floor lounge with a fire pit and staircase leading straight to the beach. The mansion also has a rooftop terrace and a huge glass pivot door facing the water. While having a private section of beach is definitely one of the home's most enticing features, keep in mind that it only offers a 0.13-acre beachfront. So, whose idea was it to create such a unique home in such a tiny space? The home's former owner was Richard Sachs, a Wall Street financier and ex-boyfriend of Ashley Olsen. He purchased the land in 2003 for just $1.9 million and transformed the place with the help of Tadao Ando, Construction was completed on the home in 2013. But what exactly about the mini-mansion intrigued Kanye? Well, it has a lot to do with originality and Ando's artistic reputation. Kanye once visited Naoshima, the Japanese art island also designed by Tadao Ando. While the home may look simplistic, its price is justifiable when you think about the kind of work that went into its creation. And we can imagine that the sunsets are unbelievable. Beachfront Malibu property, even that which is less unique to Kanye's home, is definitely pretty expensive. A home's amazing water views also make it more appealing. Sachs even said that dolphins, seals, and whales can regularly be seen from the mansion. According to Payscale.com's Cost of Living Calculator, in 2021, homes here are 626% more expensive than the national average. Redfin reports that Malibu's median sale price as of August 2021 is over $3.6 million. Malibu Mansion is just 30 minutes away from this sprawling estate. Speaking of homes with tons of space, Kanye also owns a ranch encompassing more than 4,500 acres in Cody, Wyoming. He actually bought two ranches here, each worth more than $14 million, though it's unclear what exactly he paid for the second one. The combined properties now boast an incredible amount of rooms. There's a total of 27 bedrooms and 17 bathrooms. So while Kanye's Malibu home may be small, he definitely has access to wide open spaces and privacy whenever he wants it. Last but not least, we've got to talk about Yeezy HQ in Calabasas, California. 
While not a home, the Yeezy main offices definitely show off Kanye's taste in real estate and decor. The 14,390-square-foot studio features minimalist office spaces with production facilities for Kanye's Yeezy clothing line. There's also a recording studio and meeting spaces. If we compare Kanye's studio and even his Hidden Hills home with Ando's architecture, we can definitely see that the hip-hop artist and renowned architect are a match made in real estate heaven. Plus, with a $1.8 billion net worth at the time of writing this video, Kanye can definitely rest easy after splurging $57 million on what is basically a piece of art in the shape of a mansion.